This crypto app is a game changer for the Web3 industry. You can and should download Wi-Fi Maps app immediately available on iOS or Android, and you will have access to free internet and have the opportunity to start earning crypto as soon as you download this app. This is a really exciting product for the crypto space. Check it out. This is exactly what it looks like. Why should I download it? What exactly is Wi-Fi Map? Wi-Fi Map is a successful Web2 company with an eight-year track record turned Web3. They've been in business since 2014. Wi-Fi Map already has 4 million monthly active users, over 150 million app downloads, over 1 billion Wi-Fi connections, and of course, a real working product that millions of people use every day. I downloaded this. I'm using it right now as I talk to you. Wi-Fi Map is a channel partner and is sponsoring today's video. How did Wi-Fi Map get so big with so many users? Throughout this video, I'm going to be splicing in clips from an interview that the Wi-Fi Map CEO did on Proof of Coverage podcast. So how did Wi-Fi Map get so big? There's hundreds of millions of hotspots already. There are millions of active users. How did you get to be so big? That's a billion dollar question. <laughs> Uh, it, it, it's, it's not an overnight success. It took years. It took a lot of trials and errors. At the end of the day, we follow a very straightforward uh, approach. We're very user-centered. So everything that we do has to answer the question, how is this helping our users? And uh, if there is no answer to that, then we don't even discuss any commercials surrounding that particular business venture. So it's all user-centered. It's all about solving more everyday lifestyle connectivity problems for our users. When you download this app, you're gonna see that there is a paid version with some nice bells and whistles. However, this app is available for anyone to use completely free. What exactly is the product? Wi-Fi Map brings free internet to the world. Their mission is to build the world's first decentralized wireless network so everyone on the planet can have access to free, secure internet. If you've been in crypto as long as I have, we've seen similar products, Solana's Helium, QLC Chain. I'm rooting for any crypto app who can do this. But again, Wi-Fi Map differentiates itself because they already have a working product they don't require you to purchase any external hardware. They already have a large network of hotspots. They already have millions and millions of users, et cetera, et cetera. What pain points is Wi-Fi Map looking to solve? What is Wi-Fi Map's mission? What kind of big pain points are, are you looking to solve with Wi-Fi Map in terms of how the current kind of travel and connectivity space looks today? So myself, I'm a strong believer that internet is, is very similar to water. Unfortunately, I know that people are paying for water in today's world, but ideally, you know, stuff like water, internet, they should be available and accessible to everyone, regardless how much money they have, religion, and, and so on. So I think it's somewhat of a fundamental right. I'll start with that. And... Uh, anything that myself or my team can do to, to solve that problem, to, to bring that internet to the next billion people, you know, we're all in. That's our number one mission. And then if we go into specific examples, you know, the, the, there's no limit to them, but some of the most common ones are roaming. There's still in 2023, there's a roaming problem. And, and the problem surrounds not necessarily the price and the cost, but the type of connection you are given when roaming, right? So if you go from the United States with one of the biggest telco names that promise you that same coverage in 100 plus countries, you do get the coverage, but it's far from being the same, right? So you end up on very slow 2G, sometimes 3G connections. You're capable of making the phone calls, but in reality, none of your apps are really loading. You can't really use any banking apps. Then we have the prepaid guys that deposit money for the usage, so pay per use. So all these people are very megabyte cautious and anytime there's an opportunity to use Wi-Fi, they, they take it. The reality of things, we're all hooked to Wi-Fi one way or, or another. Even if we have a regular internet connection on our phone, I'm sure all of you often find yourselves connecting to 
the Wi-Fi hotspot for better quality to just be able to do more things. Wi-Fi map, these guys, they understand that crypto is here to stay and many Web2 companies will need to pivot into Web3 or get left behind. I salute you guys. I love the product. So as soon as you download the app, you can get connected to free Wi-Fi in 200 plus countries, get access to millions of Wi-Fi hotspots all over the world. And best of all, you can add Wi-Fi networks, whether it's your home Wi-Fi or public Wi-Fi, and start earning crypto right in the app. So you can add your home Wi-Fi and let people use it, perhaps when you're not using it. Or if you know the information for a public Wi-Fi spot, maybe a Starbucks, library, office, you can add public Wi-Fi information. It's actually a pretty cool product and certainly needed in today's world. I think everybody should have access to internet, just like everybody should have access to water and Wi-Fi maps helps make that possible. Again, this app helps you stay connected to everyone everywhere. It's a number one all-in-one travel app. They offer millions of Wi-Fi hotspots in over 200 countries, helping you get internet anywhere. You can use this app to call or text with their global eSIM worldwide data package with 70 supported countries. A built-in VPN, so your safety and security is protected as you're connecting to different hotspots. We're not a Facebook, we're not a Snapchat. We're still in that utility space, right? So we kind of are being used on as needed basis. I always compare us to this flashlight on your phone, so to speak. Like it's, it's that crucial feature that you never want to delete, but you kind of only use it when the need arises. It's our job as a product to add more and more of those use cases to our app to solve more and more of our user problems and by solving them, having them become more engaged with Wi-Fi map. Is my data safe using this app? Yes, no data collected. The developer says this app doesn't collect user data. Your data is encrypted in transit, i.e. your data is transferred over a secure connection. You can request your data be deleted at any time the developer provides a way for you to request that your data be deleted. The token associated with the Wi-Fi Maps app is appropriately called Wi-Fi. It has listings on Huobi, MexC Global, and OKX to name a few. The Wi-Fi token will be issued as a reward for adding new hotspots to the platform and can be redeemed for mobile internet, VPN, and other connectivity services within the app. Now let's talk about some of the uh, really interesting stuff here, which is you're looking at launching a token. Why? So there's a few reasons for that. The number one reason is it's to further incentivize the crowdsource within Wi-Fi map. So Wi-Fi map is a crowdsourced project. We had and have people participating actively in it. We had the point system in place where X amount of points provides users with ads free experience, gives them VPN functionality and so on. But we want to do more. We do want to reward people with something that has a monetary value to it or has a utility to it. So the ideal scenario is that those active users of ours rewarded with the token that they can spend inside the app. And that's what we're looking for because we realize that a lot of these people just can't afford the service but willing to do stuff in order to get the service from us. And that's the ideal scenario. That's actually what, who we going after. That's the premise of the token to empower people to do more, to participate in our ecosystem. And then via means of the token, use the ecosystem services that we offer. So it's a, it's a utility token. You can earn by contributing to the Wi-Fi map ecosystem. You can buy inside the app to claim a discount on services. You can redeem for VPN, offline maps, eSIM data, partner services, and more. You can hold for perks, including free eSIM data, or you can refund your unused eSIM data so you never waste a single Wi-Fi token. I'm gonna to leave you with this final clip, the CEO talking about his craziest prediction for how crypto is going to evolve over the next five years Check out Wi-Fi Map website, download the app, try it out. Links in the description. Now listen to this. Craziest prediction for the next five years and how do you sort of see the crypto world evolving alongside it? That, that <laughs> interesting questions you got. 
So me, myself, I'm a strong believer in crypto, right? And the whole idea of decentralization, I've been participating in crypto since 2012. I love the space. I love technology. I think there's, we're going to be seeing more real use cases from crypto versus just projects promising to one day create the product and one day to build the community around it. I think we're going to see more and more Web 2 companies transforming into Web 3. I'm hoping to see more, more regulations in the industry. I kind of hope to, to see from regulators clean black and white rules, what's allowed, what's not allowed, so that companies can follow them. Because for many years, it's been kind of just unknown. I think regulations will bring more Web2 companies, will bring institutional investors into this game because there's going to be clear room, rules to play by. I'm hoping that people worldwide within the next five years will have more access to internet whether it's through demonopolization of the existing providers or, and allowing new players into these markets. At the end of the day, there's a lot of supply that's, that's being built. And, and that supply we see through, through the Helium models. We see it through the Starlink approaches. We drive a big demand behind Wi-Fi map. We bring a community that is actively in need. And I'm hoping that in the next five years, we'll be able to, you know, to, to put some of those puzzles together where the supply side will finally meet the demand side.